Report Sunday of Advent Year A In the first reading, Isaiah prophesied Christ's birth to a virgin and he was named Emmanuel, God with us. The Virgin Mary fulfilled the prophecy with her fiat, her consent. In Psalm 24, the psalmist lauded God's ownership of creation. Yes, indeed, everyone and everything belong to God, our Creator. We are created in His image from the womb. St. Paul gave testimony of Jesus Christ as Son of God in his address to the Romans in the second reading. St. Matthew affirmed Jesus' birth in the Gospel and related how God intervened, for it is through the Holy Spirit that this child has been conceived in her. We are drawing near to Christmas. A meaningful Advent reflection on the Nativity scene could help us gain a deeper insight into the significance of Jesus' birth and relate it to our birth and existence as well. Questions for Advent Reflection Let's gaze at the Nativity scene for about 10 minutes, then share on the following questions with family and friends. What are our thoughts and feelings generally when we gaze at the Nativity scene? Why did God send His only Son to be born into this world? If I were Mother Mary, how would I respond and react to Jesus' birth? It was prophesied by Isaiah in sacred scripture, foretold by the angel Gabriel, and fulfilled through Mother Mary. What was running through St. Joseph's mind after going from inn to inn looking for a place for Jesus to be born? How did the three wise men feel when the star led them to where the infant Jesus lay? What if Mother Mary did not consent to being the Mother of God? What if Saint Joseph decided to divorce Mother Mary? How would I feel if I were transported back in time to the actual nativity scene? Which character would I like to be? What would the experience be like? Application Jesus was born as a human being with a specific mission to save the world from sin. We celebrate our birthdays too. Have we considered what's our mission in life? What is God's will for us? Jesus' parents had a tough time looking for a room for Mother Mary to deliver her baby. Yet, they remained calm and placed their trust in God that He would provide for all their needs. We too face challenges in our lives. Patience, tranquility and trust in God will help us to rely on God to provide solutions in His time. In fact, when we are anxious, we can't quite hear God's prompting. Prayer Father God, we praise and thank you for sending us your Son, that we may have life and have it to the full, John 10.10. 10. We are so grateful for St. Joseph and Mother Mary who believed in your word. Bless us with this type of faith and obedience to your word. Teach us perfect submission so that you may work wonders through us too. Jesus, Lord, may this holy Christmas be one of discerning your holy will for our lives, our mission. Help us reflect on our birth and life. Use us as instruments for your glory on earth. Amen.